Hello subscribers. I have an official background, yay! So, I just did this tonight and I am going to be unboxing the Collector's Edition Dark Art, well, I was about to say Lollipop, Dark Art Wand. Woo! So it comes, wait, new view. Yeah, I love this new thing. All right, um, I need to scoot over. Um, hello. Sorry, it is Luna. Um, comes in this beautiful mesh felt. Yeah, I don't know what else to say. Very soft material. Squishy. Take this beauty out. Oh yeah, there's these nice magical frayed tips right there. Well, I wouldn't be going around like this, like on the tip. Be careful about that because it is interactive. So be careful, don't do that. Um, it's beautiful, like absolutely gorgeous. It does stick up a little bit. Like, see, my I need to throw it away. There you go. See, it kind of like goes slim and catches there. It's a nice gem, which I think is just fair for cosmetics and stuff. Very nice wand. Um, something I did want to point out is when you get this one, this is way better quality than. This wand, which is George's, I went over this in a previous video, beautiful, non-interactive, gorgeous wand, and I've never actually done this. Actually, George's wand is literally not even a centimeter, um, Shorter, so yeah. Um, thicker, very thicker. This is probably my favorite wand I own. This is my second, third is probably my custom wand. But the reason why I brought this baby out, my precious wand, is the difference of box quality. This thing, let's see if I can do this. You can pull out, as you can see there, it's just plastic with felt covered. And listen to the sound it makes. It clicks into place. While this thing can't move. It's literally like glued there, but it's it's actual felt. And listen to the sound it makes. No sound. That's how good the quality is. Although this thing is probably the most beautiful wand you could ever get. It is George Weasley's. I always did like his character, but I love his wand even more. Very nice wand, I love it. It's like this white, anyways. This is not a review on this. This is the review of the nice limited edition collector's wand. So, let's just look around and um, how it is, how it was, and how it will be. Um, it does come with the map. And what's really special is that this thing is completely the same as the other ones. So I'm just going around. Um, this is... Diagon Alley. I've been to both parks. I think I've, I've done videos of both parks. I think, yeah. Um, one has not been posted yet. So this is is the Diagon Alley, and this is Hogsmeade. Um, when you get this one, um, I got mine. I'm not gonna say how or why, but I got mine at the thing. And the thing of the thing, 372, no, I'm kidding. Um, but I actually got it with the thing 
that, so it comes like this actually. Um, when you enter in the one with um, Hogsmeade, and they have like everything, that's where I got it. Um, okay, there we go. Um, so yeah, I got that at this place, at that place. Um, I have quite an okay wand collection. So yeah, um, if you want me to do more reviews like this, I'd love to do that. It's crooked. There you go. Now I'm sh Now I'm straight. Um, yeah. It's, it's a good one. Wait. What I do like about my setup, because I didn't have this, and it's wobbly. It's very, very wobbly. And it's pretty easy to fall. Okay. Um, yeah. Um, black fabric. Um, but anyways, boy, I recommend this one 110% if you're willing to pay the, like, 20 extra dollars it is. This is 70 bucks. That thing is 40-something. 50 if you don't have the ammo pass. Or more. And the interactive ones are five dollars more, so it's fifty-five dollars. This thing is seventy dollars. It's Cluster's edition, and these I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. These things sell amazingly online, like one fifty, like a hundred fifty bucks when you go on to there and get it for seventy. I do like this wand. So normally what would happen is this would be here. No, the fabric go on top. This would be here and then the thing would go, oh yeah, I didn't even go over that. This would go on top. Do not go over the box. You had a good glimpse of it. It says, Wizarding World of Harry Potter, Universal Studios, Collector's Edition. This golden foil all around this Regan Black box. It's amazing. Um, but while you're here, I wanted to go over my little Harry Potter setup. Uh, disclaimer, one or two of these things are made for me. So, that's a really hard pull. Um, there we go. Um, I have my Funko Bop Giant Niffler. The baby Niffler that I got. Hello? I don't know what just happened. Um, my light keeps going elsewhere. Um, what I was saying, oh my God, um, is that I got this thing. You will plushy. Got that. Hold up, this does not need to be there. I got my DIY philosopher's stone. My green dots money. Um, my coin that was from the movies that I got from my dad. Thank you. Spirit Halloween glasses. Book. Philosopher's Stone. Newt's Commander Journal. Um, Philosopher's Stone. Um, comic. I have Hengus of Woodcroft. Card. Got from the little top of frog. This thing just walked like Harry Potter. So I put it in there. So yeah, my all my wands. All my eight now. All eight of my wands. So yeah, I'm pretty happy with my collection. Okay, so hopefully you do um like my videos better. This is where I'll probably do be doing most of my things, except like if you want me to do like nerf 50 two dart challenge or something. Then I might move up upstairs because this room's pretty small and I don't want to make this in it. Um, yeah. Um, I'm going to be just doing this for you guys. Um, for my Nerf videos, I'm really into Nerf right now. So, probably have some more of those. Just want to let you know. But I have like the Obsevere I can go over. 
the swarm fire I think it's called scavenger nerf disruptor nerf dead 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 over 20 guns so if you guys want me to review more let me know but this is Sean with my brand new setup exiting a new video and I'll see you later toodles oh that sucked I'll see you later guys bye